Hey YouTube, what's up? It's Kyle from Cairo Apps here, and as you see here, and up in the title, today we are making a scroll view. That actually works. Now, of course we're going to get straight into it. Just go ahead and open up Xcode and create a new project. Make sure it's a single view application, and we're going to name mine scroll view, just for the purpose of this tutorial. Save it to the desktop for easy access. And go into the main storyboard. Now, if we were to just go find the uh, scroll view, and weird, and drag it in, and line it up, and we were to just straight out of it, just run it, you would think that it would have a scroll view and you'd be done, right? Wrong. It does not do anything. I can pull as much as I want it. I can go horizontal. It won't do anything. Nothing will happen. Because there is code needed for this to work. So, as you see now, right there, I have the code that we actually need. So go ahead and go into the .h file. We're going to close the utilities. And open up a pair of these and close them. And we're going to make an IB outlet. And of course, we're going to name it a UI scroll view. UI scroll. Whoa. Whoa. Scroll view. There. And a little star. And we're going to name it scroller. And of course, the semi uh, colon. So, what this is, it's a IB outlet, the UI scroller, and we're going to just call it scroller. Um, if we go into the main storyboard now and open up the utilities and go to attributes, which is right there, and just click on the uh, actual view, we can just drag scroller right in here. Of course, if we ran it right now, it would not do anything. But now we have to go into the dot eight, um, dot .m file, and we can close that. And now what we need, actually need to do is we can just erase that and press tab to get right here. So what we're going to do is we're going to add a bracket and, no, not sorry, a bracket, a, uh, can't remember the name right now. Whatever. We're going to write scroller, which is already there, and then set content. And it's enabled, so just go ahead and find that. Con, no, sorry, set scroll enabled, and then yes. And closing semicolon. So what this is, it's enabling the scrolling in the scroller, and the scroller points to the UI scroll view, which is our view. Now we also have to uh, declare the size of it. So open uh, scroller, set content size, and then we're going to write CG size, CG size size make actually size make there and we're gonna go 320 which is normal and let's go five nah 1080 and of course we gotta close it and enter a semicolon not there there and that is it. Now we let's just add an image so we can actually see the scrolling uh, in the actual uh, thing. So let's just drag in one of my images and go to objects, drag in image view. Whoa, not that big. Maybe that. So you want like a little banner right there? and just go ahead and select the image and we'll square it off 
and center it. So go ahead and select Run. And there is the image there. So now when we scroll, it scrolls up. As you can see, now you can add images down here as far as you want and as big as you want. So in here, you just have to edit this. If I made this, let's say, 500, it would be only this big, and it's not that big of a difference. Um, this you should always keep at 320 because that is the actual uh, width, I think that is, of it. And that is it, guys. I hope you liked the video. Please like um, or subscribe or do both. That would be amazing if you did. But if you have any other video suggestions, you can uh, write in the comment section below or Skype me at Kyle Greenlaw, of course. Um, so, peace.